Hey guys, Austin here with WaxHeaven.com and as you can see I've got a little box here. Um, I just sort of picked this one up on a whim. Upper Deck Sweet Spot 2010 Football from the hobby shop I was at today. Um, Dick and Jane's in Jacksonville, Florida if anybody's interested. I'm going to try and for the most part identify where I buy cards. If it's from a, a shop or if it's online or eBay or whatever. Um, and then I'll also be pretty upfront about how much I paid for them too. Just just as a good policy. Um, for this I paid $22 I believe. I have no idea because I did not do research ahead of time uh, if that is a fair price. I'm assuming it's not too far out of line but you never can tell I guess. Uh, there are only eight cards in this box. Um, this is the first experience I've had with the product so I'm kind of excited. I hope I get some of my money back. It. Um, it's a bit of a scratch-off lottery ticket, I feel like, but we'll see. One box, one nice thick pack. Upper Deck 2010 NCAA Football. I'm going to cut the pack instead of ripping it. What do you think? We got anything good? Oh, jeez. Okay, it feels like more than eight cards. What is this? Oh, there's one that's very, very thick. All right. Hey guys, uh, sorry the camera actually went dead, so I'm downstairs now, um, which is actually good because I'm in front of the computer and uh, had a chance just to look this up here. Sweet Spot was released um, on the 15th of September. Um, 100 regular card base set. Looks like the signatures are definitely more valuable than the actual swatches. Uh, let me go through what I pulled here. This is a little awkward. Let me balance the camera very quickly here. This is, this is a little awkward. Alright, so I guess this, is, this will have to do, this is a little awkward, but here's what I pulled out of here. Philip Rivers. These are base cards. Um, a little hard for me to read it. David Reed. Uh, Matt Stafford. I like Matt Stafford. I might actually do a Matt Stafford collection, so I'm, I'm sort of glad that I pulled this. Um, there you go. Matt Stafford. I'm happy about that. Um, Devin Hester. Uh, Andre Johnson. Whoa, there you go. Andre Johnson. Um, Drew Brees. But those Drew Brees, right? Um, Heinz Ward, nice, I guess. And then the uh, the hit was uh, Sweet Swatches, Troy Aikman. Um, sort of a double patch there, some dots on the one side there. Um, looks like on eBay that sells for four to six dollars. Um, and then sort of weirdly misleading um, is this gigantic, super gigantic, it's like a brick, um, Upper Deck 25% off coupon for Upper Deck Store. I'll, I guess I'll block my code so nobody can steal it, although I don't think anyone cares to steal it, but um, do you want to get 25% off? Yeah, why is this the biggest card in the pack? Slightly misleading. Whatever. Um, don't think this was a particularly great pack, um, but I like the product. I like how the cards look. I uh, would love to get an autograph. Um, need to do a little more research on this. this. This might be something I want to try and collect a little bit more of, depending on costs. I looked it up at um, dacardworld.com. Uh, I paid $22 for this at the hobby shop. This was just kind of purchased on a whim. They're selling online, $18.95. Uh, it's um, uh, also available in a larger set where you get six, uh, six of these boxes, six packs for, it looks like about 80 bucks. So that would actually be a much better deal if I want to get into collecting these. But I'd like to hear your thoughts on the product. Um, have you bought any? Do you like it? Have you pulled anything cool? Um, hit me up, wax7.com. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.